The ocean is full of animals from many decades ago. And in this episode, we will talk about turtles. Turtles have traveled the ocean for ages. Over the past 150 million years, they've swum along with massive marine dinosaurs, witnessed the evolution of the first whales, and seen the slow movement of continents. Sarchalon is the largest to have ever lived in ocean, weighing at 2,200 kilograms. This four and a half meter long turtle has a shell coated with leathery skin, which means more protection against the shark. Its large teeth crush the clams from the seafloor and sharp beak to snare slippery squid. While this ancient giant is not extinct, many other turtle species survive around the world. They are born on land, but they race from the beach to the waves evading hungry predators, moving into deeper water as they age. They survive by consuming sea grass algae, sponges, clams, squid, shrimp, and jellyfish. Since they are cold-blooded, they can't survive in colder waters, so they explore temperate and tropical seas the world over, traveling with currents as they grow. They can live for over 100 years and have a slow aging process. Some species might even only reach sexual maturity when they are 50 years old. They return to the same beach where they were born when they are ready to mate. This may be on the other side of the world and scientists have been curious about how they navigate their way. Their brains contain microscopic magnetite crystals, according to a study. This mineral acts as a compass in the brains of the sea turtles, allowing them to sense changes in the Earth's magnetic field. They can locate the exact spot by recalling childhood recollection of their birthplace and travel. Though they survive prehistoric predators, shifting temperatures, and major extinctions, these skilled travelers, sea turtles, are well suited to life in a slow lane. They are confronted with modern difficulties that put their survival in jeopardy. Many turtles shock when their breeding beaches have been rebuilt by people after decades when they return to their nesting places. Nesting is impossible on paved or compact surfaces, and strong man-made lights confuse hatchings as well. As a result, fewer hatchings survive predators and reach adulthood. Additionally, adults are frequently harmed by plastic pollution caused by humans. Countless turtle mistake floating plastic bag for drifting jellyfish and dive from complications. Many initiatives to restore habitat have been effective, despite huge human threats for marine life. Hundreds of militias spent two years in Mumbai clearing up 5 million kilograms of trash and planting trees to help with erosion control. Turtles were pleased and for the first time in decades, they returned to lay eggs. With inspiration and organization, humans can work together to make ecosystem thriving habitat for all.